Good morning, I'm Sylvie Patrick. Let's do a great workout this morning. You only need your body, a mat. I like to work barefoot, but you can shoot at home to have your tennis shoes. We're gonna take off the mat from our power plate. You're gonna place it on 30 seconds and start your machine. Let's bring the heel first, toes towards the chest, and we're stretching the hamstring. If you need a wall, by to keep your do that got one more second there hit repeat switch legs Everything is stiff on the morning, so move it in all direction. Keep the toes towards your chest. Hip flex the stretch. Hit repeat on your machine. You need to feel the stretch in that legs in the hip. Moving to the other legs. One more exercise for the stretch. Bring your hand on the power plate, hit repeat. Let's move those shoulder a little bit. Hinge at the hip, keep those heel on the floor, contact with the floor. Very nice, we're starting with our first exercise. Right foot on the plate and tap. Keep your body weight on the front leg. 15 seconds, we're gonna come and bring that knee up. Want you to grip with your toes, arch, your foot on the power plate. Hit repeat, we're going to the other legs. Fifteen seconds, I bring my knee up. Balance. You need to control the move. If you're flopping your arm all over, go slower. Let the time to the body to really recruit. Good. Feet parallel. Static squat. We recover. My body weighs on the ball of my foot, so I don't feel the vibration to the head. Oh, moving to this side now. Hit repeat and tap. This is called the frontal plan. Fifteen seconds, get on the single legs, in.
We're going to the other side, but you can turn. You know what the exercise is about. That's one of the advantage of having a personal. You can move 360 around it. 15 seconds, single leg balance. This is a narrow squat now, same concept. Keep the squat static. Recover. Body weighs on the ball of the foot so I don't feel vibration to the head. If I need to lift a little bit my heel, I do. Last step, it's in the traverse plan. Open and come back. Like if I want to give a ball to a partner behind me. You can challenge yourself on that one too. Single legs. Your legs should be starting to feel the exercise now. Stick with it. We don't rest. This is a short exercise. 30 seconds. Open the hip. Challenge yourself coming at single legs. Open. Single legs. Good, last squat and rest. We're switching from wide stance to narrow stance. Five more seconds here. Once you got, we're going for upper body. Get on those knees. Bring your hand parallel. Hit repeat. Elbow are in. I line up my shoulder, hip, and knee. Hold it there. You're working triceps, chest, your deltoid, your shoulder, and your core. Five more seconds. Good. We're going to be sitting on the platform. I'm going to turn it so you can see it. Sit on your platform. Hit repeat. Place your hand on the edge. Get your body weight off the platform. Bend the elbow. Open the chest. If you want to challenge yourself, Another tricep exercise. I'm gonna be leaning sideways. My left hand is on the plate, my other hand on my shoulder, and I'm bringing the shoulder to the plate and pushing it away. It's called tri-rise. You're gonna feel it in the triceps. 15 seconds. 10 more. Airplane flying by. It's okay. Doesn't hold our workout. Continue on the other side. You can see my hand at the same height that my opposite shoulder, and I'm pushing away.
Moving to core here. Put back your mat on the plate. 30 seconds. Drive your navel down. If you need a little ball, I like the bender ball. Put it in your back. Have your hand on the plate or on the floor. Or challenge yourself. If you can't, just one foot at a time. Lifting up. As long as you keep that navel in the right position. Going to the side. I'm on my glutes. Same thing I'm showing you. You can do this movement first. Or you can challenge yourself, bring both legs. Fifteen seconds. Feeling it in my obliques. Two, one, switch side. Hit repeat. Again, you can start here if it's all you want to do. It's a nice massage on the opposite glute. Five seconds. Good. Last exercise. I'm doing a plank. My elbow are off the platform. Those hands parallel. Shoulder are neutral. Hold the plank. Five more seconds here. That's it, it's already time for a nice stretch. Bring your hip here. If you don't have the flexibility to do this and to lean over and relax your upper body, you can also bring that legs here, keep it open, massage the hip. You can also check my video with the foam roller that will show you how to release the lower legs and your hip. Switching side. Here you can bring the power plate on a high amplitude if you want to. 60 seconds if you have the time. And last exercise, never skip it. I'm gonna place my machine on high and 60. And massaging your calf. The back of the knee. We have some lymphatic network. And it's very nice to stimulate here. I'm completely disengaged and relaxed. Massage the bottom of your foot. If you are spending a lot of time working, standing up, or in heel, it's very nice as well. Thank you for working out with me this morning. Have a great day.